When I first saw her, uh, I thought she was me. Aren't they cute? He's not my type. That's the first thing that I said. <laughs> Apparently, he is her type now because Shalia Boykins and Jaron Carson will soon be husband and wife. The two Memphis teachers say they want their marriage to last. You have to be sure that that's the person that you want to be with. Absolutely sure that that's the person you want to be with for the rest of your life. Many couples just plan a wedding rather than think about the marriage that comes afterward. But Jaron and Shalia recently went through a premarital counseling program called Before You Tie the Knot. They believe there are important premarriage issues to discuss. For instance, number of children. At first I wanted four, mm -hmm. and she looked at me kind of crazy. <laughs> I went four. Uh, she said, well, let's, let's start with one first. I think all couples should do some kind of marriage counseling because a lot of couples Couples are not surviving marriage, and to me, I know when I stand up there and I say I do, it's important to me that it is forever. Tennessee's high divorce rate has been a state embarrassment and country music cliche for a long time. But since 2000, it's gotten better every year, part of a national trend. This program looks to build on that. We cover four areas. We talk about communication, naturally, handling conflict, parenting, and money matters. UT Extension teaches before you tie the knot in Shelby and other Tennessee counties. Couples learn about so-called I messages rather than you insults, a proper and civil way to disagree. I feel upset when you're an hour and a half late, or I was concerned that you forgot to do thus and so, rather than you're always late or you never remember. UT Extension also trains the trainers in not, including many church leaders who then work with engaged couples. So several times during the interview or during the session, we asked, do you still want to get married? Because we want people to understand that this is a marriage course. However, you may not choose to get married once you finish because we paint a real picture. Shalia and Jaron know every day won't be all sunshine and flowers, but they're prepared for a future together, one based on honesty and grounded in reality. This is Chuck Denny reporting.